So today I'll be trading a ten dollar account, and the asset I'll be trading is synthetic indices. So if you're new to synthetic indices, go to the beginners class on my website. I will drop a link to that class on the description of this video. So do where to check it out. Today I'll be trading a ten dollar account, and uh, currently my balance is ten dollars, as you can see, and. Uh, I'm not taking any trade for today, and this is today's date, 21st of February 2024. I'll be recording all my trades, and make sure you watch this video to the end because I'll be dropping some trading tips as the video progress. The first tip I want to drop before I start taking any trade is, if you're trading a $10 account, don't risk more than a dollar on a single trade. Never risk more than a dollar on a single trade. So with all the trades I'll be taking today, I'll be risking only $1, and the risk reward ratio to be either one is to one and above once i see any trade opportunity i'll continue the video guys okay guys this is the second trade first trade moved so far so i wasn't able to record it and this volatility 75 1s index this is where i bought the asset this is my take profit and this is my stop loss remember always use stop loss and take profit that way you be able to lose exactly the amount you want to lose since i want to lose only a dollar on this trade then there's every need to use stop loss that way i'll lose exactly a dollar so let's see how the trade goes i'll continue with this video when it either hit my tp or my stop loss okay guys this is another trade and this is where i sold this asset and this is my stop loss and this is my take profit i'm actually pursuing a risk reward of one is to five uh, there are some other trades i've taken before this trade but i couldn't record it because it moved really very fast so i'll explain why I'm pursuing a risk reward ratio 1 is to 5 on this particular trade. It's almost very close to my TP. Okay, guys, I'm done for today. Let's see how much we're able to make today. I started with $10 and currently I have $16.99, almost $17, guys. And when we go to the trade history, I made a profit of six dollars ninety three cents. So these are the trades I took. All is volatility seventy five one S index. This is my first trade. It closed on a loss. That's I lost just a dollar. That's why I keep saying that if you're trading a ten dollar account, don't risk more than a dollar. Just in case if the trade goes against you, you won't lose a huge chunk of the account. Okay. Now the second trade I pursued the risk reward ratio of one is to two. I achieved that. So at this point, I was already on profit of a dollar, okay? And uh, the second, the third trade closed on profit. I pursued the risk of one ratio of 1 is to 2, which I was able to achieve. The fourth trade, I tried to pursue a risk of one ratio of 1 is to 4, because currently at this point, I was already on profit of $3. So I was willing to risk a dollar just to pursue 1 is to 4. So I couldn't achieve that, though I achieved one is to two and in reverse and hit my stop loss. That just it. Because it's my profit, I was not really bothered. So the last trade I pursued a risk reward ratio of one is to five, which I succeeded as you can see. What happened here is that uh, when I started my first trade for the day, I didn't want to pursue a high risk reward ratio. Okay. Just take this as one of the tips for this video. When you, you're starting the trade for the day, just pursue lower risk reward ratio like one is to one, one is to two. When you're already on profit, then you can use part of the profit for that day, just a, a part of the profit for that day to pursue a higher risk reward ratio. That is if you're very sure that the setup you're looking at, we achieve that for you, okay? So if this video was helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel. And if you're new to synthetic indices or forex trading, you can visit my website, nkfsacademy.com and take advantage of the free class i will drop the link to that class on the description of this video so do where to check it out talk to you guys on my next video